What's up guys, welcome back. My name is Sean and today... Oh, who loves the flow of this? Shoo oh. up! The emotion, the power... And then it just explodes! <laughs> okay. What's up guys, welcome back. My name is Sean and today we're going to be reacting to TXT at the SPS Coyote Hedgehog 2023 with 3D, Sugar Rush Ride and Chasing That Feeling. So guys, we are back with some more TXT and we are finally this week getting into some of the many award show performances that have been appearing around here at the, the end of the year. That is of course because we are also doing our own award show here on the channel and I thought as such we should use the weeks up to and probably also the weeks afterwards on the other award shows to kind of get some get an idea of what it takes to to do an award show obviously we did this isn't actually an award show anymore i believe they don't actually give out awards but it used to be an award show this music festival thingy here that sps does i am excited it seems like we have one solo performance which will be the first one we're checking out with uh yonjun from txt and the rest will be group performances and i'm excited for all of it let's get right into the first one though yonjun with 3d alternative version I don't know this song, but I like the instrumentals. It's a little groovy. I can touch it through the phone, or kiss it through the universe. In another time zone, it's the only time I can reverse. But when there's two dimensions, there's only one I'm missing. And if you okay. Liking this, I just want to sit you like that, sit you like that. Oh, so if you're ready, and if you let me, I was very slick with it. I gotta say, like it's very sharp, it's very on point. The different moves. Oh, that, that move was dope. Okay. Hey. Yo, he's covering a lot of bases with this solo. Singing, rapping, dancing. It's very fierce, very powerful that. Hey. Doing some good ad libs as well. Hey. Hey. Okay, gotta go showing a little muscle. I love this part of the stage where it feels kind of like freestyling dance, you know? Jumping around, having fun kind of stuff. Being free. Alright, alright. Hey. 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 Oh, that positioning was nice, that repositioning. Small step, kind of... Mm. God damn, okay, that was uh, the first performance we're checking out from the SBS Kaiyo 2023. That was Yeonjun from TXT with an alternate version of 3D. I, again, I do not know this song, so I'm not completely sure how this is changed from the original to be like an alternate version. Maybe it's just the dance, maybe it's the way he's singing, maybe it's like the whole feeling of the song, I have no idea, but he killed it. I really, really like just the, the slickness of the whole stage. It really, really feels like, you know, 
he, he's got everything under control kind of vibe, which I think is super dope. I also love how he's able to kind of show off a lot of different aspects of him being an idol through this stage. He's able to do his singing with some very, very nice, some very prolonged, very stable vocals throughout this song. But he's also able to, you know, tap into a little bit of that rap, albeit very, very slightly, but quickly do just tap into that, that little bit of flow and pace. And then, of course, the dancing is immaculate. It, he looks really, really good dancing, getting really, really slick with it and even when even in the past of Takaro that uh, he where, where he does the same thing as the backup dancers he just stands out because of the way he's kind of doing it incredibly slick and I really like that but we've got more to check out let's get right into the group stages which will be both of one both of them in one video is going to be uh, Sugar Rush Ride and Chasing That Feeling let's go chirping are there people in those seats behind them it does not look like there is i'm not sure okay very fancy let's see Oh, and holiday version for choosing that feeling. All right. Mm. It's a little low volume wise, but nice vocals so far. Hey. Hey. You kind of get teased on the chorus through that uh, from the ad lips. Yo, those ride vocals, got them. That was cool. That part of the curl, him laying down and the other one moving under. The death melody was kind of teased in the verse. I didn't notice that when we initially listened. Hey, hey. Yeah. Little, little intermission part here. Okay. This is like the, in some transition into chasing that feeling, or Ooh. Ooh, that's a little scary. I love the imagery though, With the hands feeling stuck, feeling caught. Hey, 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 hey! Okay, a little dance break to break with. And it's all five of them joining in on it. I love that. Ooh. Picked up the pace instantly along with the music. Still got the same kind of vibe to the dance though, which is dope. We're gonna get into chasing that feeling now. Because that did remind me of them kind of almost as if this is how they ended up in the sewers. Where they had the powers where they split up. Little red riding. Oh, I, I forgot. It's, it's like a holiday version. This. Oh, it's the girl with the matchsticks. All 
side, we got the jingles going. All right, this is not bad so far. It's actually really nice. I love how I'm kind of toned down the instrumental feel with it being Christmassy. It's all I know. It's all I know. Okay. Like the choreo fits the song so well. Ooh. Ooh. Because I'm not sure if this choreo is toned down compared to the original one, but it feels it fits perfectly into this Christmas version either way. This is a little, it feels a little toned down, which the instrumental does as well. Oh, oh, oh. All right, that was TXT with both Sugar Rush Ride and Chasing That Feeling Holiday, holiday version. Love both of these songs. Love how they've been for performing them. It's just overall, it seems like TXT have a really, really good grasp on actually performing on stage, which I think is really, really nice. Already, we could already see that from Yunjin's solo, where he kind of, he's kind of able to still make this the, the stage all about him, despite there being a lot of other backstage dan dancers or not backstage dancers, backup dancers. Despite obviously, no, he does have a red jacket on which gives him a little bit extra contrast which gives him a little bit extra spotlight but when we actually look at this stage as well we really see them get into some synchronization get into some contemporary kind of kind of dance you know some storytelling within their dance love how we also have a dance break that really plays into this storytelling part kind of showing that emotion of, of feeling stuck with those hands kind of coming out i'm caught up in something but in the end they uh, escape to the sewers uh which of this time of the year i guess is some some Christmas sewers. They have some Christmas holiday version of Chasing That Feeling, which feels like the actual instrumentals is a little bit more of a toned down version of it, but still it's got the essence of Chasing That Feeling. It's got that grooviness. It's got those vocals, especially here at the end. We got a really nice high note and everything. I really love this stage. But yeah, guys, that was Yunjun's performance of 3D as well as TXT's performances of Sugar Rush Ride and Chasing That Feeling holiday version. All of it on SBS Coyote Hedgehog 2023. What a long title this video is going to have. I love this. This is one of the things that I love about just these end of the year shows like music festivals, award shows is first of all, these covers that we get, these uh, solo performances, these special performances, what we this time got from uh, from Yunjun where he covered 3D, which uh, uh, according to my research I just did is uh, a song by Jungkook from BTS so love the fact that he actually was able to kind of meet up to the probable expectations that were for a song like this and he did incredibly well I really really liked his performance how he was able to stand out on stage and as the same can be said for the rest of the group in both Sugar Rush Ride and Chasing That Feeling and how they kind of cobbled the two together with some kind of storytelling where it seems like they're getting caught up in some some emotions and they're moving from this 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 foresty feel that we had in the music video from Sugar Rush right into this city setting that we had from Chasing That Feeling. Obviously, those settings weren't on the actual stage, but the transition is kind of what we got through that dance break in the middle. And I just love that whole storytelling part. But let me know what you guys thought about 3D Sugar Rush Ride and Chasing That Feeling at SBS Coyote on 2023 by TXT down in the comments below. And I guess I'll see you guys next time. Psst.